Good morning everyone, it's the Goy Hunter. Today is June 12th, it's the big day. Uh, but I'm at that Dollar Tree again. But I just noticed that the Weekly Wow is not the movie poster, so I'm nervous. We're going in there. If I'm shooting and you don't hear me speaking, it's because the manager there is very strict. And he knows my face. So I don't want to get 86 out of there. Let's dive in. Yeah, I was like, okay, I guess. Oh my God. This full bag full of goodies. They moved the movies. Yay. The store was a success. Look at these goodies. Well, there's only 35 movies in here. Well, let's move on. They didn't even have... Dollar Tree bags. They have to put it in a trash bag. Everyone, we're at the second Dollar Tree. I don't see the weekly wow sign. Oh no. This time I remember my book. I was so excited about the first Dollar Tree that I didn't wear my gloves. Let's see what the weekly wow. Oh, they got it. Let's go in. They have it in the front. Hi. They had pretty much the same stuff. I only found uh, about with very few. But let's go to the next Dollar Tree. We're back at that nice Dollar Tree. Let's see. Do they have the weekly? No, they didn't change their sign. But we're going in because she promised more movies. Yeah, there's some. Okay. So I went in the back and they had some more. Here's my stack. This is added more to my stack bag. My garbage bag. This Dollar Tree didn't have bags either. Huh, maybe they ran out. Then to the next adventure. Hey everyone, now I'm at this Dollar Tree. I never have to look at this one. So, you know, it's a weird entrance you have to go around. We'll see. They're not that nice at this Dollar Tree. But, who knows. I'm in the neighborhood, I might as well try. Okay, let's go in quite a bit. Oh, let's do it this way. So let's dig in. I'm craving hot dogs. I'm stopped at Davina Schnitzel for some good old hot dogs. Yum, yum, yum. Hi, it's Boy Hunter taking a break. I got Mountain Dew. Hold on. Davina Schnitzel. And here's my corn dog. Hold on. Then I got my mustard dog, all beef, yum, yum, yum. And then I got my crop dog. Ooh, look at that crowd. Ooh, hold on, let me sanitize my hands and we'll take a bite. Welcome back, folks. Wow, the bun is soft. Oh, hot. Mm. A Dollar Tree. That's way out of the way. Good afternoon. I don't know if they have anything. We'll see. Time to post stuff. So we can watch. Oh. Lots of movies. Oh. Hello, ha! Koi Hunter is back from her Dollar Tree extravaganza hunt, and I think I did okay. I wanted to find more movies, but I guess they're not in my area. Anyway, before we begin, I really want to give a shout out to Mr. P Mac Movies. He graciously gave me a plug on his video 
and from the bottom of my heart thank you so much because as he's a veteran so I look up to him again PMAC thank you so much and we'll be in touch and I have such a big haul that it's going to be a long one folks I'm warning you right now go ahead and get some snacks get your dinner your lunch your breakfast something to drink sit it down in front of you and turn me on and just relax and watch let's start oh uh, how can I forget before we start we gotta give away a movie okay today we are gonna give away black Klansmen black Klansmen uh, you go to universalredeem.com and I will give you the code now 10 9 8 7 6 5 4 3 2 1 BAM I hope someone won that one I know it didn't expire yet Make sure you comment below if you want it or not. Okay, here we go. The first one up, Minds Game. Uh, this is going backwards. They released the Blu-ray in the last haul, and so now I picked up the DVD to complete the series. Let the mind games begin. Let's see. Sam Neill is in this. It's a mind-bending thriller to the next level. So, I bet you guys already watched it, so we don't have to go over that. The next one, this is a new one. I Saw the Light, Tom Hiddleston, Elizabeth Olsen. If you remember her, she was in that movie Burlesque. I Saw the Light, the story of Hank Williams. Hank Williams. I wonder if they she did all her own singing in this let's see I saw the light is a story of the legendary country western singer Hank Williams who in his brief life created one of the greatest bodies of work in American music good who love autobiography movies sorry I have a cough drop in my mouth the next one for western films collect collector set Another Echo Bridge release. We have Death Rides a Horse, The Gun in the Pulpit, Kid Revenge, and Vengeance Valley. That's the back. Uh, let's see if there's anybody famous in it. Mm. Oh, Lee Van Cliff is in Kid Revenge. And that's that one. The next one. Ooh. <laughs> I was excited I got one of the Xbox games, Madden 17. Oh, Xbox One, excuse me. Yippee, I'm going to try and play it. <coughs> the next one, I was all happy to find. Tekken Kazuya's Revenge. Ooh, another movie in the Tekken series. Survival is no game, and you know I love my martial arts movies. Let's see. Oh, uh, um, it doesn't really say. He just comes back with a vengeance. We'll watch and find out. Oh, the next movie I just grabbed because it's cheese delicious. Corey Ham and Corey Feldman and Busted. Look at that cover. You can tell that they um, superimposed that hat on his head. Um, faster than a speeding airplane. More powerful than naked gun. I'm going to cover up the lady. She's a little obscene. But this is the back. It is another screwball comedy. The Summer Resort of Amity Houses, the wildest officers on the eastern side seaboard. Oh, this is another adult type of film. Adults only, please. Corey Ham and Corey Feldman. 
busted. The next one. For all you Smurfs lovers, Smurfalicious Journey, the Smurfs. Explore the world, the whole, the whole Smurfy world. This will go into my Smurf collection. The next movie, Running Red, Jeff Speakman, Angie Everhart. The business of killing just got personal. Uh, if you remember, Jeff Speakin Speakman was in The Perfect Weapon. Uh, he is a martial artist. And I did work on that film. And the film was supposed to be set in Korea. So we, I did recruit all real authentic Korean background artists. But they didn't understand English. So when the director yelled cut, one of the people that were driving the car crashed it so they had to reconsider it and then I hired Asians who understood English so it was better anyway Jeff Speakman was trying to be another martial artist star I don't think he he made it but at least he is in this film it's an Echo Bridge release 2005 um, it is a murder by numbers game I believe he is playing a, it's a military. I'm sorry. We'll just have to watch it. The next movie is a five movie action pack. Chuck, it's a Chuck Norris, Lorenzo Lamas, Antonio Sabato Jr. All those hunky, interesting men. Let's see. Chuck Norris is in Logan's War and The President's Men and The President's Men Part 2. Then Lorenzo Lamas, CIA 2, and Antonio Sabato Jr., Chaos Factor. So, I don't know if you remember Lorenzo Lamas. He was in that CBS, oh, Flamingo Road? I'm not sure. And Antonio Sabato was that hunky gentleman in uh, Janet Jackson's video. Oh, I forgot. Oops. Anyway, that should be fun to watch. Ooh, this one I'll enjoy. Action Collection 4 DVD. 19 movies. Bruce Lee, Chuck Norris, and Steven Seagal. I hope it's the Steven Seagal that was able to move. Because lately, when he makes movies, he just stands there and... People attack him. Wow. Well, it's not the real Bruce Lee. It's the Bruce Lee imitators. Bruce Lai. And... There's a lot. The real Bruce Lee, which is not. Um, Breathing Fire. Fist of Bruce Lee. Driven to Kill. That's a real Se Steven Seagal movie. And that's when he was younger, so he actually did perform his martial arts. Another Echo Bridge release. Oh! oh, 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 oh. You know I love my creep. <clears throat> Sorry, my creature features. The Snow Creature includes four bonus movies. Look at that. I love it. I love it. Here goes the back. Let's see. The Snow Creature, Curse of the Wolf, Blood, Blood Predator, Chupacabra versus the Alamo. Wow. That should be fun. Ooh, another bonus movie border cross with Lorenzo Lamas and Danny Trejo they took their his son he'll take their lives that's an interesting match those two and here's the back and the bonus movies are riot and executive target oh boy I uh, let me read the synopsis Xboxer Danny Trejo Danny Boy Jackson, Lorenzo Lamas, only left the room for a second and a human trafficker snatched his son. With the help of Danny Trejo, uh, they go and retrieve his son. The next one is the original classic George A. Romero's Night of the Living Dead. I had to grab this one. Here's the back. Uh, this is an Echo Bridge release, believe it or not. And 
everyone knows the synopsis for this. It's a classic. The next one, wow, they're all movie collections. Walking Thunder includes five bonus movies. This one is with John Denver. That's the only name I recognize. I guess these are about the wagon train west and surviving with your family. Oh, uh, where the red fern grows is on this. That's good. The return, the return of Rin Tin Tin. That sounds great for movie night with your family. The next one, Hollywood Adventure Film Series, four feature films. Another Echo Bridge. Oh, Echo Bridge must have been cleaning out their warehouse. Uh, let's see. Here's the front. I do not recognize any of those names. Seven Doors to Death, Hot Rod Girl, Blonde Savage, They Made Me a Criminal. Oh, uh, John Garfield, Garfield is in They Made Me a Criminal. I recognize his name. That's an oldie but goodie. <clears throat> now, I have never heard of this TV sh series. Love That Bob, Volume 1, 8 episodes. I have never heard of this movie, and I was born in the 60s. It's a hit television show by all accounts. The Bob Cunningham Show, retitled for syndication, is Love That Bob, highlights the romantic misadventures of Bob Collins, Robert Cummings, a suave bachelor and photographer. Then, um, I guess, I guess that must be his kid. I, I don't know. That should be an interesting watch. The next one was an upgrade for me because on the three hauls before I got Frank DVD. Now I have it in Blu-ray. So that's exciting. Maggie Gyllenhaal is in this, and Michael Fassbender, I think he has a small itty bitty part. So, it totally rocks. It's the man with the mask on his head. Then, oh, another family film, Echo Bridge, Top Enders, Asari, Peter and Pompey, and The Gift. I believe these are all family films with an, an animal in it. Oh, that's going to make me tear up and cry. Animal movies get to me. Let's see if there's anybody we recognize in this. Uh, no. That's fine, though. Everyone should always have a chance to act in films. Now, this is a great one. Martin and Lewis. Colgate Comedy Hour. Eight episodes. Dean Martin and Jerry Lewis in the beginning of their careers. Look at those youngins. Before they both started smoking too much. Let's see. At, see, at the height of the 1950s, variety television was a craze. A hilarious comedic duel, Dean Martin and Jerry Lewis teamed up for the wildly popular series Martin and Lewis. This classic TV. The next one is Life. Ooh, another BBC Earth, narrated by Oprah Winfrey, from the makers of Planet Earth. It is a four-disc set. Look at that beautiful cover. It is a DVD version. Um, that's fine. I'm really excited. From the this, from the BBC and Discovery Channel. Produces of planet Earth. This is the remarkable life cycle you've never seen before. Four years in the making. Life. Love it. Love those documentaries. Now, I think this is an upgrade for me. I got the DVD. I Melt With You. Rob Lowe, Thomas Jane. Je Jeremy Piven from Entourage and Christian McKay. That is a great cast right there. And here's the back. Ooh, I love movies about friendships. And that's what it is. Uh, fr four college friends who gather near for a hardcore weekend. Ooh. 
They're forced to face up to their real lives after college. Okay. Another Xbox. These are the. This is the only two that I found. NHL 17. I'll be trying to play that one too. Who I was I excited for a dollar? An Xbox One game? Oh man. Oh chills. The next one brought movie. I mean, sorry, memories. It's Popeye the Sailor and Betty Boo. 54 classic cartoons. Oh, I remember sitting, waiting after school to watch these cartoons. I wonder if it's in black and white. This is another Echo Bridge release. Let's see. It doesn't say. But who cares? Ooh. You can never watch enough cartoons. The next one... Is Monsterland. I love that cover. I love the red and I love the clear case. And here's the back. I think I already bought this at Hamilton Books. Hmm, well, now it's a dollar. Well, oh well. Totally off the wall in Grizzly Horror Anthology. A monster is good time. Amidst a bloody black drop of chaos and carnage. One panicked, lonely survivor of the monster apocalypse takes shelter in a movie theater. Sounds great already. I want to watch it now. Wow. The next one is... Well, they released a 4K version of this on Hamilton Book for set $9.95. And then I saw it for a dollar as a DVD, so whatever. I bought it. Pride and... Preju Pride plus Prejudice plus Zombies. That is interesting. I had to read Pride and Prejudice in high school. Did you guys? I don't remember it at all. Lily James is in this. Sam Riley. Lena Hetty. Ooh, she's pretty. Let's see. A zombie outbreak has fallen upon the land in this reimagined Jane Austen classic. That's hilarious. Oh, man. Jane Austen must be rolling in her grave. Let's see. The next one, I couldn't believe it. I had just bought this on eBay for $10. And now it's a dollar. Wild bird, I mean, white bird in a blizzard. I almost fainted when I saw this. I, heard, I saw the previews of this and it looked so good. That's why I ordered it in advance. But then I bought it for a dollar, so now I have two, but that's fine. Let's see. Oh, <clears throat> excuse me. I love movies when it goes back and forth uh, from present to the past. Uh, this is a thriller, and I'm looking forward to that. Now this I found. I only found one. Jinja Yain. This is a Thai movie. This girl is badass. She's best in the business. Now, this movie is a magnet release. So you are don't expect good acting or the script to make sense. Just watch the action. Because I watched some of it. And I, I was getting frustrated because I didn't understand what was going on. Then I just forget it. Don't understand it. Just watch it for what it is. A Thai action film. Oh man, this one made made me tear. Schwarzenegger, the Terminator. Even though everyone already has it in how many different versions, but it's a new release and it's beautiful. And new artwork to add to the collection. The Terminator, a classic. The one that started it all. And then I remember this was a DVD and then now it's an upgrade to a Blu-ray. A place at the table. I haven't gotten around to watch it. It's a Magnolia release. I guess it's 50 million Americans, one in four children, don't know where their next meal is coming from. Oh, it's a sad documentary. I'm sad now. Oh, this one was a was a great find. Double feature. Peanuts. Snoopy Come Home. 
and a boy named Charlie Brown in a red case. That's a good seller. Here's the back. Who didn't love Charlie Brown back in the day? Classic. Oh, man. Jack Nicholson, The Wild Ride, A True King of the Road. Look at that young Mr. Jack Nicholson. When I saw that face, I grabbed this. It also includes four bonus movies. Another Echo Bridge release. Wow, Echo Bridge is really smart. Um, they're going into the archives to get the old movies that these famous actors, uh, when they started their career. Wow, in Split, in the other movies, there's um, Slipstream with Bill Paxton and Mark Hamill. Guilty Conscience with Anthony Hopkins. Mesmerized with Jodie Foster and John Lithgow. Darn, this, this one is good. It has a lot of um, big name actors. The next one is an upgrade for me because I found the DVD first. Power Kids. Power Kids. Another magnet release. Well, re-release because it was a Chinese film and then it came to the States. And it's about kids who can kick ass. Excuse my French. Power Kids. Another action Asian film. And then I found a tribute to Paul McCartney. Another classic. And I guess he's singing... Some of the songs and other people are singing to him. So for all the Paul McCartney lovers out there, this is out there. You can find it at your Dollar Tree for a dollar. The next movie is a classic, Barber Shop, Ice Cube. This is such a funny movie. Anthony Anderson is also in it. Cedric the Entertainer, Eve. Another comedic movie about a barber shop, but all the drama involved as well as comedy. The next one is a great segue. This is another upgrade because this was a DVD and about two hauls ago at Dollar Tree. Richard Pryor, Omit the Logic. A comic genius this gentleman was. He set the standards, he opened doors. Uh, most, a lot of comedic people owe a lot to Mr. Richard Pryor. Uh, let's see. Mike Epps, Richard Pryor Jr. It's a documentary paying tribute to Richard Pryor. Look how young he was in that. I did work in one movie with him, Another You, uh, with Gene Wilder. Oh, look at this. The Smurfs Collection, another Smurfs. DVD. Uh, four great movies for one price. The Smurfs, Smurfs 2, uh, The Smurfs, The Sleepy, The Legend of Smurfy Hollow, <laughs> and Smurfs, The Christmas Carol. I want to watch that one. That's going to be hilarious. And now I found this. I've never heard of it. Lex, the complete first and second seasons. The most imaginative sci-fi since The Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy. Lex. I already... The cover already intrigued me. I really enjoy that kind of artwork. Oh, it's another Echo Bridge release. It is, uh, let's see. Four misfit characters who have inadvertently stolen the most powerful weapon of destruction ever made a Manhattan sized genetic of uh, genetic modified insect ship I, I think I better watch it before I try to understand that when is it time it's time for the second movie giveaway now this one is said it may or may not have expired but this one is worth a try right right it's John Wick. You go to movieredeemer.com. 
when are you guys ready this is really tiny I'm gonna try and get it as can you can you see it one two three four five six seven eight nine ten I, I hope someone won that one in because that was so tiny I'm sorry the next one is a classic Yakuza movie, Outrage. This is a great film about the Yakuza. Uh, it's a Magnolia release. It's nerve tingling. Um, it's a Takahashi Kitano movie. Uh, if, no, if you don't know, the Yakuza is a Japanese mob. And they're usually all tatted up. But they never get tattoos on their hands because they, it, they're very secretive about their tattoos. So nothing below the wrists. So that's why they always wear suits. So you can't see their tats. Great film. I, I'm shocked that Dollar Tree got this in. This is a gem of a gem. The next one is a BBC video. Earth, the biography, the story of our world. Now, I thought this was released on another prior Dollar Tree haul, but it wasn't. It looks identical, the cover. It was an um, exciting haul. You know, I love that BBC. That was a great find. Now, I know a lot of people found this. Uh, I've watched this film on Blu-ray. I already have it. But I bought it on DVD, Predestination. This, what a twist ending. Twist, twist, twist. That's all I'm going to say. You need to watch it. Because if I talk too much, I might give it away. Ethan Hawke, great performance. Predestination. Grab it if you see it at Dollar Tree. Okay, I'm not into rom-coms. But I didn't have this in my collection, but I bought it. So I could complete it. The Ugly Truth, Katherine Heigl and Gerald Butler. Look how young they are. The Battle of the Sexes is on. A sassy, sexy, screwball comedy. Eh. Maybe if I just want to put something on. The next one, I was excited to find it. Harold and Kumar Escape from Guantanamo Bay. Cal Penn and John Cho. Look how young those babies are. I like those Harold and Kumar series. I wish they made more. The next one? Classic cartoon collection. Over 50 cartoons. Here's the photo. Superman, Betty Boop, Mighty Mouse, Felix the Cat, Casper, and Popeye. These are the cartoons of my time. Excuse me. Uh, oh, this isn't Echo Bridge. I thought it was. It is Go Entertain TV. And then... Boy. Oh, this one caught my eye. Demon Hole. Just the name itself. It says, Evil Has Emerged. It, that demon has a nose ring. Look at that. I guess he's a hip demon. And then here's the back. This is an Echo Bridge. It says, six teens doing community service, work in a remote forest, have no idea what a freaking crew has drilled. Oh, on a, na a sacred Native American ground and unleashed a demon. There you go. Demon hole. And then, I found this beauty, a huge Bonanza set. I believe there's five discs in this. I was excited to find this. Michael Landon, Lauren Green, classic Western history in TV series. Right there. And then, we have this, Against a Crooked Sky. Four more westerns, another Echo Bridge. 
It has battles of Chief Pontiac, Sitting Bull, the Great Indian Wars documentary. So it's educational as well as entertainment. Entertaining. Oh, I was excited to find this with a slip cover. The Villainous. With a beautiful slip cover. I already had the Blu-ray of this, but I couldn't resist the slip cover. And this one has a uh, Rotten Tomatoes, one of the best years action film, an endless vengeance war. Uh, let's see, Kill Bill, La Femme Nikita, and John Wick. She's all in rolled into one. I guess she's going to go on a bloody rampage. Okay. The next one is very close to my heart. Pearl Harbor, 75th anniversary. 16's movies. My parents were teenagers when Pearl Harbor was bombed. So they were there when it happened. But they're both gone now. But they told me stories about the war. Pearl Harbor in Honolulu, Hawaii. Uh, let's see. The movies are Kamikaze, December 7th. I don't see any big name stars in it. Oh, wait a minute. I just saw Ronald Reagan. He's in Recognition of the Japanese Zero. Starring Ronald Reagan, one of our presidents. So this should be a good find, if you do find it. And now I've, I got this because I thought it was so cute. It's for all you parents. It's uh, Pokoya, Learning Through Laughter. As, oh, it's seen on Nick Jr. I guess Nickelodeon, I am assuming. Whether it's playing a new game called Boo, you can engage and enjoy time with your kids. They'll learn about telling the truth using their imagination. That sounds good. These are for all you parents. If you find that. Ooh. Then I found Beast Legends. Mythical creatures brought to life. Wow, you know, I love... This is a BBC. And here's the back. Look at the griffin. Let's see. Griffins, wild men, and dragons. We've all heard the stories about these strange and undeniable creatures. But is it true? Scientific? Or fantasy. You gotta watch this. The next one. Oh, the Terror. Boris Karloff and Jack Nicholson. Another one when he was just starting out a new one. Look at those young face of Jack. The only thing more terrifying than a haunted castle is being trapped in one. Here's the back. Wow. You'd never think you'd see those two together. And this was a platinum release. Oh, I let me read a little on the back. When Napoleonic Cavalry Soldier Lieutenant Andre Duvalier, Jack Nicholson, becomes estranged from his unit, he comes upon a mysterious woman named Helene along the coast of Germany. I guess she leads him back to the castle. Mm. Suspenseful. Wow. Classic. The next film, I think it's Pi Watkit? Pi Week? I do. Sorry if I killed it. It's a horror film. It looks like a, a tree from the producers of The Witch. Fantastically cre creepy. An effective, suspenseful horror. Let's see. When you're dealing with... It's a demon film. Let's try it again. Pie Whack It. Maybe I got it right. Maybe I didn't. And last but not least from this haul, Nine Movie Christmas Pack. Look at that. Let's end on a cute little note. Look at those nine little movies for Christmas. Echo Bridge, of course. Let's see, we have Scrooge, 
the great Rupert, Santa Claus, etc. I don't see anybody, any big names in it. <gasps> Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer. Oh. Woo so that was my second Dollar Tree haul. Yeah, my second one. And I'm going to go out again to see what else there is. But before I leave you tonight or this evening, one more digital code. To redeem this, <clears throat> you go to iTunes.com backslash redeem. It's Peppermint with Jennifer Gardner. It's, I've worked on this film. This is one of my last films before I retired. Here's the code. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Boom! Good luck, whoever gonna win that. And thanks for watching. And again, I want to shout out to PMAC for being so, those kind words really got to me. So please like, subscribe, comment below because I do answer all of them, even if it takes me a while. Smash, smash that notification button so you know when I'm going to drop down another video. Well, there, of course, is going to be another Dollar Tree hunt. Again, Goy Hunter out. Arrivederci. Take care and be safe from the Goy Hunter.